Hey, what's up folks? This is Keith and you're watching Barber's Auto Help. Today I've got a quick tip for you, or a warning if you will, and it concerns disconnecting your ignition coils while diagnosing a misfire. Pretty common practice to have the engine running and disconnecting your coils one at a time to see if there's an RPM drop, and if there's not an RPM drop on whichever coil you suspect is misfiring, then that's where your misfire is located at. Uh, however, that can get you in a lot of trouble on today's vehicles. Uh, a lot of your three wire ignition coils, you're not supposed to disconnect these things while the engine is running. And the reason for that is you can blow your computer and or the ignition coil. Uh, the three wire connector here that you see has a power, a ground, and a signal wire uh, that receives an on off signal from the computer to the coil and I believe what happens is when you disconnect this while it's running uh, there's a voltage spike that can be sent to the PCM through the signal wire and it'll blow the PCM and or the coil. Uh, how do I know this? Well it happened to me. <laughs> I was trying to figure out a, a misfire on a four cylinder and I disconnected the ignition coil and there wasn't an RPM drop and we suspected it was the ignition coil so I replaced the ignition coil while the misfire was still there on that same cylinder. Turns out that uh, when I disconnected it, I blew the computer. And I also figured that, or also found out after the fact in one of my training classes that you're not supposed to do that. You're not supposed to disconnect these while it's running for that very reason. So, that being said, just be warned. Uh, be careful when you're working on your own vehicle. The object of the game is to save money, not spend it. So, have a repair manual, heed all warnings in the repair manual, and understand your repair manual. And be careful. Thanks for watching, guys.